What is going on, everybody? My name is Steven or Z Crowns here, coming at you with my fourth episode of Wager Survivors in Angel 14. And today we're going to be wagering. Oops, sorry, didn't mean to press that button. We're going to be wagering a Milestone Briere. Yes, we are too smelly kick, but you probably know him on Twitter if you follow me. A fellow Bruins fan of mine. And sorry about my voice, guys. I'm just not. Kind of sick under the weather, but you know. Decided to pump this video out. It's going to be good. Why do I have John Carlson up there? Anyways, alright, so, yeah, here's the team. First line's looking pretty good. Um, so, and he's giving up Hot Live Jack Johnson. I forgot to say that. So, let's invite him to a game, and let's do this thing. <coughs> alright, so I have seen on Twitter that Smelly Kickbutt has a pretty decent team, so I'm really... Kind of scared. Oh, he's a Grabner, Gagne, and I can't see who that other player is. I think it's Hemsky. So that's a pretty good first line. It's going to be all hot lives, and uh, let's get into this. There we go. Bergeron walks in and goes backhand forehand to make one nothing. The quick early lead. Let's go. Good start for us. Oh, wow, what a play by him. But he just missed that. Oh, that was very close to a goal. That was a nice play. Uh-oh, he almost had a break there, but he meant to pass it to his other player. Just missed him. Could have been gone on a 2-1-0 there. That was bad defense by me. Oh, but there's good defense by me. Bufflin. Bufflin away. Big buff. Oh, nice poke by him. Nice poke. There you go. Phil Kessel to Danny Abriere with 3.3 seconds left in the first period to make it 2-0. That is a huge goal right there to get the 2-0 lead going into the second period. Nice goal by Danny Abriere. Obviously, he put that in the net because he wants to stay on my team. He doesn't want to be going to Smelly's team. Not at all. Good goal right there. So there we go, officially done the first period. I think it was pretty even in stats. I just got two more goals to him. It is 2 nothing after the first period. Um, the stats, I'm sure, are pretty good around the watch and the replays here. But um, that was a pretty good period. He's got his chances. I got my chances. He missed on that really great chance that passing play. I think I just capitalized on my chances. My players are a little faster than his, so it kind of puts me at an advantage. So let's see the stats here. Oh, wow. 7 to 2 the shots, I would have thought it would be a little more even, I had more time on attack. So I was all over him, I guess. But still, in potential 14, you never know what can happen. So, second period, let's go. Try to keep this up. That one covered some ground all the way up to the neutral zone. Oh, nice goal right there by Gagne. I went for the hit again, left Gagne wide open, and he just sniped on top right. Good goal, good goal. So he's pulling between and one. The 2 nothing lead is the most dangerous lead in hockey, but hopefully I can hang on for this game. Still lots of time. Alright boys, so Anderson makes another great save right at the end of the second period. We are still up 2-1. to one. Yeah, still up 2-1, to one, so good game, a good period goes so far. It's going to be a really good game. This is going to be a really, really going to be good. Really going to be a good game for the third period. The stats are definitely going to be even this time. So, look at that save by Anderson right there. Maybe you won us this game. May Might save this game. Yes, yeah, shots are the same. I've just got a little bit more of attack. Time on attack. So, let's go. Back and everything's good. Ooh! The nasty glitch goal to get a lucky goal. Wow. Holy cow. I did the flick average po pro shot over his defenseman and got a really lucky goal here. Oh wow, he definitely put that in his own net, but it still counts. So 3-1, to one, Seidenberg puts it in on his own net. Kind of unlucky, but unfortunately it counts for him. So 3-1 for us. Uh oh, so he snipes one off the draw, makes it 3-2. to two. I don't know what my goalie was there. I think he guessed the wrong way. That was kind of a weird, weird. But anyways, it still counts. That's a nice goal by him. I think that was Taylor Hall. Yeah, Taylor Hall. So I want to see that goal again. Actually, I think my goalie went the wrong way. Let's see. Or did it get? I think it may might have got deflected. Oh yeah, it got deflected by Bufflin. Well, anyways, three-two. This game is not over whatsoever. So we gotta finish this one. In. 
He has 10 seconds. He has one last rush. Oh my gosh, he hit the post. He hit the post. Oh my goodness, what a game. Oh my god. What a game to smelly kick, but I want to go to instant replay right there because holy cow, that was close. Hits Bufflin. He gets another shot. Five old boing right off the post. Wow. Holy cow. Great game. To smelly kick butt, and I'm going to list up a contract, and he's going to send me Eric Johnson. Alright, so we have received a trade offer, and there we go, Eric Johnson Hut Live. So, awesome game, the smelly kick butt. Thanks for paying up in the wager. And, um, so guys, please tell me if you guys like this episode. Please leave a like, subscribe, comment, do what you guys gotta do. And tell me who I should wager next, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out, boys.